My next competition will be 5 km swimming without now raining cold water around this island in Mürbisch, Austria. Let's see it! Mürbisch and Neusiedl Lake are located on the Austria-Hungarian border. The area of the lake is very big, more than 300 square kilometers, but maximal dip is only 1.8 meters. This means the temperature of the water is very sensitive to the weather changes. Information about this competition can be found on swimfestival.at website. Uh, there is an English version of the site and you can find here the competitions. This is three day event and uh, there are a lot of swimming races here. The swimming race where I will swim is the five kilometer around the island. So you can find here the most important information about this uh, swimming. And uh, what is interesting that this race is uh, part of the GSS Global Swim Series and uh, they have actually two categories, swimming with neoprene and without neoprene. Since I will swim several races in Serbia, Bosnia, Croatia, where the water is warm, I will swim without neoprene there. That is why I registered it here and decided to swim without neoprene. The competition will be in two days from now. Today it was 18 degrees Celsius. That may be a little bit cold for swimming without neoprene, but we will see. It's 11 p.m. and she is not sleeping yet. In six hours from now, I have to leave Budapest and going to Mürbisch to swim five kilometers. Sunrise in Budapest. It looks like today everything will be around number five. This is my fifth open water competition in Austria in this year. Uh, it is 5 in the morning, I sleep 5 hours and today I will swim 5 kilometers. It is 5 30 in the morning uh, and now I am on the M1 highway leaving Budapest. In uh, two and a half hours I will be in Mürbisch. I checked the water temperature this morning, it is uh, 19 degrees Celsius, but that's still very cold and it will be very interesting because I'm swimming without now print. It will be interesting. Rainbow. Hungarian Austrian border. Let's see, will it be stopping or not? And no stopping on Austria border either. Great. Great. The weather is very nice. No, there are almost no clouds. It is 20 degrees Celsius now. It is 7 in the morning. So I hope the water will warm up a little bit today. And almost there is no wind. I saw some wind mills. Uh, they are rotating very slowly, so there is almost no wind. I hope that will be the situation next to the lake because there will be no waves then. It will be easier for swimming. Mürbisch. My neoprene stays in the car. I bring it just in case, but today I'm swimming without neoprene. There is a lot of parking place here, so that's absolutely not the problem. That's what I like it.
this is a track <laughs> this is a registration and we will swim this way around the lake the water temperature 20.2 degrees celsius that's good because today i will swim without neoprene that's almost comfortable temperature we will see so uh, there will be my base i put down and my stuff and now let's see the track so our start line will be somewhere here and there we will have a first turn to the right around this island actually i am on bridge now this is island and we will go on the other side and there are some orange bows which show us the direction there we have to uh, go to the left because there is the finish line i was here three or four years ago uh, and then actually the start was from this smaller island there is some theater here some summer theater let's see the smaller island now i am on a smaller smaller island and uh, well, there is a channel behind me so the big island which we have to go around it looks like this so you cannot walk on it okay i am going back now to the my to my base and uh, wait for the start the start will be in one hour from one hour approximately More than one and a half hours. This time is very bad. A few minutes ago, I just finished my race and I got the finisher medal. And I felt fantastic. So, uh, without now, it was 20 degrees Celsius, but it looks like that's perfect temp water temperature for me without now print so uh, I noticed that my time is more than one and a half hour what is very bad time for five kilometers I don't know I will see when uh, I see all the results to compare with others uh, but um, it was, uh, that way the wind direction so most of the time we, we 
had the wind in our back only here in the last maybe one one and a half kilometers we have uh, wind in, in opposite direction and it was very hard uh, to swim there you can see somebody is still fighting against the wind somebody is still swimming it was very hard to follow the boats the, the boats were uh, really far away so actually uh, when I uh, left one bow I was swimming approximately in direction I was watching that uh, the island will be uh, on my right side and then after a few minutes then I can spot the next yellow bow so it, uh, sometimes the distance between bows is very hard so it uh, and uh, it was very wave on the opposite side of the island uh, so orientation in open water swimming is very important Thank you. Um, last name? It was the chip renting. Uh, we paid 23 euros and we, we returned the chip after the race. We get 20 euros back to us. And now, I lunch ticket. Bye bye, Mervish. Austria Hungarian border. They are slowing down. And this is the end of the line. They will wait at least half hour or even more, 40 minutes. I woke up at 5 in the morning and now it is 5 p.m. And finally I am home. The results can be found on the swimfestival.at website. There is a direct link to the raceresults.com website where you can find the results of all events which were on this festival. The most important is the swimming across the lake. And uh, five kilometers of the swimming around the island. This is the neoprene class. And this is the class without neoprene, so this is where I was second in my age group. Interesting that I feel comfortable in 20 degrees Celsius water. I just checked my body mass index on 10kg.org website and this is just another proof that <laughs> I am overweight. <laughs> okay, now uh, let's talk about uh, what I liked and what I didn't like on this competition. Huge parking with a lot of space because there is a theater and probably because of that there is some extra space for parking. The location, the Strandhaus beach is very nice place to go with the family and spend there a weekend for example because there is a, a water park, swimming pools, mini golf. Really professional organization, this is three day uh, swimming event and the organization was on really high level with a lot of sponsor, lunch in restaurant. Medals, not only for age categories, but also we got medals for finishers. That's very important because you got a, a nice souvenir from the location, even if you don't get any medal in age categories. Here was what I didn't like. Shallow water, especially if you swim around the island, the water is not too deep. Sometimes I was touching the bottom of the lake. And the water is not so transparent, actually I cannot see even my hand uh, in the water 
and I always missing the wardrobe or package storage because this is public place and you have to leave the, your stuff there until you are swimming so I don't feel too comfortable because of that that will be it and if you like swimming and you find this interesting don't forget to subscribe and you will get notification about my next videos thank you for watching and uh, keep swimming